Hello, my name is Dave Peterson. Uh, I've been 32 years here in southwest Colorado near the San Juan National Forest. Uh, I'm a hunter, a conservationist. I am a caretaker for several hundred acres of private property, absentee owned, and ORV overuse and especially abuse have ne has negatively impacted all of these areas, important areas of my life. Uh, OHV abuse and overuse has wiped out most of my best easy access hunting places and at 66 years old when I need to be hunting closer to the road uh, because I hunt on foot and carry my animals out on back I'm constantly getting pushed further back into the wilderness just like the elk are because the motors are everywhere. As a caretaker for private land uh, I have to deal with trespassers on ATVs and motorcycles all the time and the big difference is the ATV I can I can get the motorcycles because dirt bikes because they have plates on them but ATVs don't and these guys wear these dark helmets and for a landowner or a caretaker it just makes it almost impossible they can laugh, laugh right in your face and just write off and there's no way to identify them even if you've got a camera so we really really need the common sense legislation nation, nationwide and here in Colorado that uh, to mandate identifiable readable license plates this will not only discourage the bad guys from taking so many chances but it will it will allow any honest outdoor user to, uh, hunters anglers just backpackers bicycle riders even other OHV users honest OHV users to become vigilantes everybody carries a cell phone and a camera uh, this is very necessary the other side of that same equation I've got a lot of game warden friends talk to people at the sheriff's department uh, enforcement is they almost it's like why should we go to the trouble to try to run these guys down and take them to court they're gonna get a fifty dollar fine uh, we've even had this is what they're telling me we've even had people come up and say hey can I go ahead and pay my fine ahead of time because I'm gonna ride off trail illegally if I kill something to recover the game uh, it's just ridiculous um, it's really time to do something about it and I really I'm pleading with my elected officials in DC and here in Colorado agency managers let's set this right we've got a problem out there we've got hundreds of thousands of these things nationwide uh, and no way to regulate them uh, I hope you'll listen to me and the other voices you're going to be hearing from all across the country saying the same thing don't let this minority continue to override the majority of public lands users thanks